Hi beautiful, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a full get ready clean. We got my hair, we have my makeup, we have the outfit kind of sorta, and we also have my nails. So stay tuned for that and let's get into it. Hi beautiful, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a get ready with me. I'm gonna do my hair, my makeup, and I don't know why I'm doing this intro. I'm probably gonna do this intro before. Girl, scrape all that. I'm gonna do my makeup. I'm gonna do my classic brown smoky eye. The same one I've been doing for three years. I got like a three years ago today notification one time and I think I screenshotted it, but I don't know if I did. I really hope I did. And it was the brown smoky eye that I had on that day. I've been doing the same thing for years, you know, if it ain't broke, don't change it, so that's what we're going to do. I have my brows on already, and I like to let my concealer sit because it just makes sense to me. I don't have no reason. And I also decided I'm going to start using this mirror so I can, like, stop looking down. Because I, I feel like my, my brows be looking weird when I go like this. And they don't really look like that. I mean, damn, do they... <gasps> when people look at me, they do see my brows like that. Anyway, y'all don't need to see my brows like that. If you want to see my brows like that, you gotta catch me in person. But in this video, baby, my brows gonna look right. So I'm just gonna blend this out. And when you leave it on for long enough, it blends out so, like, easy. This is the LA Girl Concealer. I I watched, I mention Aaliyah's face on my channel all the time. But she's, like, one of my favorite, like, in, beauty influencers right now. And I don't watch a lot of beauty influencers in my, like, free time. So she's like the only one I have to like reference for real. So I like a, a few others like Savannah Silver I bring up a lot. Who else do I like? I don't know. It's not. It's drawing a blank. But I admit those are like the two I mention a lot. And I learn a lot of my tips from them. I mean of course like Jackie and stuff. But like everybody likes Jackie. Like who doesn't like Jackie? Why wouldn't I like Jackie? Yeah anyway. I was watching. Back to the, to the point at hand. I was watching Leah's face um, talk about how it's important for us to leave links in the description box so I have now decided that all my videos are going to have links to all the products that I use I'm going to just try to be real happy about that I'm going to try to start using my links because I can get coin on my nourishment income but like no you guys be wanting to know what I have and then it let me start doing my eyeshadow before I just keep talking I'm going to take this old ass Morphe 35O palette because why not and this eyeshadow look is literally like a two eyeshadow thing like I'm not even gonna prime my eyes it's really not even that deep we're just gonna do it I'm gonna use my finger because I have my fingers out oh I'm also gonna be doing my nails I didn't even mention I'm gonna do my nails too so while I have my fingers available I'm gonna use them to get this dark brown eyeshadow and just put it onto my eye cuz I don't have any clean brushes you guys be want to know about what I'll be using and like I, as a person I just really hate being questioned and it's nothing against y'all but like I don't know, is it a Virgo thing? I just hate when people like try to question me. And and I don't know if I chose the right profession because people be asking me questions. It's just not, I, I never try to get smart with y'all. That's why I don't be responding because I just weep. I don't like being questioned. But, um, you know, we're just we're just going to dead that. No more questions. I'm going to leave the link to everything. Don't you worry. I'm going to find the link to all that I can. And then I'm going to put more effort into my description boxes. So if I can't find the link, I will say in the description box, I can't find a link. Absolutely none of these colors look like I want, so I'm just going to go ahead and use my bronzer. My bronzer does multi-purposes as so many different things, so right now it's going to multi-purpose as an eyeshadow. I'm using my NYX Matte Bronzer, and um, the shade it's in the shade Deep Tan. Link will be in the fucking description box. But like, for real, I'm so like serious about that. I'm going to start putting the links to everything. And I'm just going to blend this out. This is really the easiest eyeshadow thing ever. Do I even really need to talk? Like, I feel like you know what's going on. Oh, oh, uh, let's let's like catch up on the old video I did of like the drama. So, Lana came out again and talked. Even though nobody told her to do that. She could just, I just, shut the fuck up. But she came out again and she said some more, some more words for some reason. It's just, it's just like you're not covering your ass. And I, I don't want to talk about it too in depth because that's not what my channel is really about. Like drama, but like, I don't know. Why do celebrities do this themselves? They get a kick out of this? Like, is it fun to them to not be liked anymore? I don't get it. It's hot. It's, it's hotter than a bitch in this bitch. Fuck. Am I wearing clothes? Who knows? I'm talking so much. Okay, that's the one of the right thing. I just really wish celebrities would just stop talking, but even though I said that already, I just feel like her, like, apology or whatever, it really didn't even, like, apologize. She just said, that's not what I meant. You guys took it wrong. I, I gave reparations to the Native American people. I lost Doja Cat and Lana Del Rey in the same week. 
you know how hurtful that was to see them act like that like that's what you be doing in, in your privacy of your own home you be acting like that and with the doja cat thing i'm, I'm just choosing to ignore it because you know that sign can't stop me because i can't read i'm gonna listen to her music in private i can't talk about it no more because she showed her ass but I will be spending that per EP in the privacy of my own home and nobody's gonna tell me anything about it. I'm really opinionless on it because I just feel like there's too much shit happening in the world for me to care and delve on these smaller issues. It's like we might as well just focus on the bigger issues like police brutality, which I'm also not gonna dive in too much either because it is it's really upsetting to talk about. I don't know the drill, if you don't know, now you know. I'm using the Elf Luminous Putty Primer. I don't know, I can't say anything else about this, this primer. I've said all there is to say. I really thoroughly enjoy it. It's so hot in my room that I just try to get some and it's just fuck. I'm gonna use all of it though. Cause why not? Okay, so I'm gonna briefly explain what's going on if you're just having to be living under a rock. Um, this is the tea. The terrible tea. This isn't like good tea. It's terrible actually. Um, I'm trying to make it lighthearted because it's the situation itself is like really it like makes me feel away and like the only way I can talk about it is just like not taking it too serious but it definitely is a serious topic please don't think that i don't care or like it's not serious to me but it definitely is george lloyd i believe his name was he was held down by a police officer and on his neck even though he was handcuffed um continue to say he can't breathe there's a video service of it there's several videos of black men being murdered by people and i honestly i don't want to see any more black men being murdered on camera I'm sure nobody wants to see that and I'm sure that my feelings of not wanting to see that happen are very minuscule to the actual like the issue at hand which is police brutality so me feeling like oh I don't want to see that is like not even it's like it's not on the same level but I, I just feel like we shouldn't be broadcasting these people's deaths i mean we should all be aware but like out of respect to the people's families and things like why are we sharing around videos of this person being murdered i it it, it desensitizes us from the actual from from like death i don't i don't know how to word this and that's why i don't really want to talk about these kind of things i don't feel like i know how to word myself in a way that's like perfect but Especially like on the topic of like police brutality, it's like you have to watch how you say things and to show my standpoint of the situation, I just want to say that police officer is a murderer and getting fired is not enough. They need to go to jail. They took a life. They need to do life. This is the LA Colors um, Ultimate Cover Concealer in Honey. It's just, it's just like we either sit there and don't talk about it and be like numb from not talking about it or we talk about it and we talk about it some more for it to only happen some more it's just like what do we really do <sighs> it's just really sad nobody deserves to get their life taken away like that oh the lady who called the police on the man for telling her to put her dog on the leash and she and she he, she with a video of her like strangling her dog oh white people went crazy over that they said you're not gonna hurt this innocent animal forget this black man this dog you can't be out here doing that and that's why they got her ass up there and now she said her her life was ruined well maybe you should have thought of that before you tried to do that that's what i'm gonna say about that we have an issue in our country and i don't think me talking about it is gonna do much to to, to help defer the issue but i don't know I don't want to just not say anything, but I also want to say too much because I don't feel like I have the words to say what I want to say. Tell me about that my foundation matches though. Let's change the topic into a very lighthearted topic. I'm just, I hate that I started like that because like how do we go back into let's do our makeup because like people are dying. <sighs> this is the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer and I really like it. Okay, on a lighter note, <laughs> I'm going to change the topic to, to these women. These women on Twitter, why this girl on Twitter? I'm not gonna put her ad or nothing on the screen because people start harassing her. She had to lock her page that I saw. But this girl, this girl tweeted, y'all ever fuck with a nigga so heavy, y'all clean his house? No. I ain't never. And that girl quoted it, this is, this is the kicker. The girl quoted it and said, not gonna lie, I mowed a nigga lawn once. You. If, if, if it's like, jump off this building or go mow a nigga lawn, I'm jumping off the building. 
Never wear a wig again. Modus nigga lawn. I don't know. I'm not in mode nigga lawn for one time. But it would, it would like, take a lot of thought for me to, to, to go out of my way to help a man mow his lawn. Y'all different. Another girl told her, like, so y'all not going to do his laundry and do his dishes if he, he left real quick just to help out? No. I'm just thinking maid. I'm just thinking mom. No. I mean, like, if we live together, we're living together. I'm still not mowing that fucking grass. But if we live together, I don't know the circumstances on how she got to the point of mowing the nigga lawn. Like, did, she, did he just say, oh, babe, I don't feel like mowing this lawn? Or was it like, he's... Paralyzed. Bitch, I'm paralyzed. I cannot move. He's paralyzed. And the, the only way that his lawn will get mowed is if she mows it. I don't know. It was just like, what was the circumstances to the point that like led you to want to do that for that man? And y'all niggas ain't out here like little baby. See, I briefly touched on the Jada thing before, but like 200 occasions. <laughs> 200. A occasion and I'm not going back you got me fucked up yeah I'm going back got me two Birkin bags every time he cheat okay but like these niggas do not be providing with any benefits they just break your heart and I don't know I was gonna say use your car but I ain't never had no nigga use my car but like yeah that's how I be I put it on my story I was like y'all doing this and like the majority of y'all said no and I see y'all and I'm, I'm so proud of y'all for having a head on y'all shoulders. But a few of y'all said yes. And I just want to know what's up. How are you following me and, and subcuming? 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 It's a word. I'm a, it's a word that I'm trying to say, but I don't know what the word is. I look up the word I'm trying to use. Succumb. It's succumb. It's to fail to resist pressure, temptation, or some other negative force. So why are y'all giving in to these men? If you follow me... I don't know, maybe I haven't been too vocal about it on this channel, but I hate y'all niggas. I'm gonna set the rest of my face with this LA Pro face. And this is in the shade Classic Tan. I'm gonna go to bronzing my face. NYX Night Bronzer again. I wouldn't say I'm going a little lighter on the bronzer today, but it kind of looks... Wow. I don't know what I'm doing differently right now, but like... Maybe it's the way I'm putting it on. I don't know, but it looks different. I like it. This video has been everywhere. To Lana Del Rey, Police Brutality, hating these niggas. I don't know where I was gonna go. Uh-uh, my whole, <sighs> this is a joke. I'm not even gonna tell you what I'm looking at, but just know it's a joke and my highlighter is a joke. AKA, it broke. When Alyssa Forever first started doing the little inner corner like highlight I, and her brown smoky eyes, that's that's where I got the brown smoky eye from. Let's give a shout out to Alyssa Forever. We don't ever say her name on the channel, but we will say her name right now. Alyssa Forever really was like the one for this brown eyeshadow. I gotta, I'm gonna blend this out with this brush because it's clean and this looks like it needs to be blended out a little more. But Alyssa Forever was really the one that was like doing brown eyeshadow. <laughs> Y'all bitches wasn't doing brown eyeshadow and highlight on the corner before Alyssa Forever was. And that's just period. And then, boom, my eyes are finished. I'm just going to throw my lashes. Today I'm going to using my v by Envy Peach Echo. And I heard that they're on Amazon, so guess what? There's going to be a link to them. And I'm going to go ahead and trim these to fit my eye. So now it's time for mascara, and I'm not going to stab myself in the eye this time. I'm not going to stab myself in the eye this time. I'm not going to stab myself in the eye this time. It's crazy. I never do it when I'm off camera, but as soon as I get on camera, it's like, let's stab the fucking thing in my eye. So my hair is installed. Yes, there's a video on this. This Get Ready With Me will be up first. Really quick, though, I want to grab my spoolie from my brow pencil. I don't know. Do y'all notice I just be forgetting what things is called? And I'm gonna dip it into my wet line and just use it as a brow gel. Regular old brown lip pencil. You can get one from anywhere. I get mine from the B-Spy store. I get like all of my shit from the B-Spy store. It's like I really live there. I don't know why they haven't sponsored me yet. Lips are lined. Now we're gonna go in with the Karuchi Colourpop Collab, collab in the shade Chi. But I really don't think this is available anymore because it's that old. It's so old. This is old. Do you guys have like a suggestion for a nudie pink um lipstick? I'd appreciate it. Boom! I got on this baby fat shirt. It's so fucking cute. I just feel like so cute. So now that I'm done, I think it's time I give a formal apology to those that follow me on Instagram. And I had asked that if y'all want to see a tutorial 
on the half up half down curly hair and a lot of y'all said yes and then I got this hair in the mail like I literally got it in the mail today I washed it I bleached the knots like all that just so I could wear it so I could take these pictures I, I, I wanted this wig for this look so yeah it didn't happen today but I just want to say I'm sorry so let me go on Instagram and tell y'all that I'm sorry real quick so I promise that I'm gonna do the half up half down tutorial now it's time to talk about my nails real quick. I'm going to show you guys me putting on my press-ons. A little small glimpse. Not too, it's not going to be like an in-depth thing. But I really do want to shout out my nail tech. Um, due to the virus, I haven't been able to get my nails done. But I absolutely adore my nail tech. My name is Adoria. I adore her. She's fucking great. She's amazing. So it comes in this little package. She said she does ship, but I actually went to go pick mine up. But I asked her for you guys if she does ship. She said she does. Um, this is just, I love my nail tech. So I just want to tell you all about this. I had this set on, uh... Yesterday, it lasted for a week, my set did, and it was so fucking cute. I hope you guys can see, but if not, I'm going to also add, add a video of her showing them to me for the first time. They were great. This today, I, see, I, I've been planning this look for a long time. I literally got nails for this occasion. So, it comes with an instruction guide and, you know, how to do it and her business card. What I'm, I'm going to show you guys me applying them and I'll also show you guys her Instagram or whatever. I feel like you guys should strongly support her because... You know, who doesn't want their nails done during quarantine? This isn't going to be a majorly in-depth nail tutorial, but I do want to show what I got. Um, my nail files, some alcohol pads, some press-on little pieces, some nail glue, and a little buffer, and a cuticle stick. And, y'all, <laughs> it's just best. I'm going to let y'all know in advance. If y'all really do end up shopping with her, which I really strongly do recommend you do, it's just best that you put the nail the press on stickers away for your other hand first before you get your hand of nails on because girl you're gonna try to get them stickers off with that newly nailed hand it's gonna be hard but this is my set it's the extra large set my nail size is a medium i believe but on the smaller side it's like a c medium but she'll ask you to measure your fingers so she can get you the perfect nail size for you I love my nails. I really love that other set that I showed too. And they lasted for a week. And this is just how the distract the distractions. The distractions, the instructions, girl. The instructions told me to put them on like this. You put your nail glue on your bed and then a little press on sticker and then nail glue on the nail. And then you just go ahead and press that bad boy on. And then after that, you're all set. And you just repeat this process for all your fingers. And I mentioned I really want to emphasize, if you do this, please set aside your little press-on stickers before you get your other hand on because you're going to have a rough time peeling it off. Okay, so that's how I do my nails. My nails are finished. I'm going to give you guys a brief like, look at my outfit. But first, I want to go ahead and add my secret weapon. I love glowing. Like I like highlight. So um, I use this ColourPop highlighter in the shade... Girls, it's called Butterfly Beach. I'll have a link to it in the description box. And I'm just going to go ahead... I use this big brush and I like to just it's cream so it lasts like a long time and it gives like a nice little shine oh I have to show my outfit I guess I'll stand up real quick you'll see pictures I'll have a picture on my cover but I'll show you a picture of what I'm about to go take outside hopefully because the sun's kind of going away and I'm kind of scared so here's my shorts they're baby fat shorts can you see them? can you see them? Period. So that's all this outfit is. It's just a top and bottom from Baby Fat. I'll have both of them linked in the description box. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll probably be doing more of these like full get ready for me. So stay tuned for that, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, beautiful.